you ready for the pandemic to finish? Are you ready for the next chapter? We might not know how that exactly is going to pan out, but certainly it is becoming clear that some people are okay with living in cities and regulation, and that's okay. And some people like nature and want to be starting Aquarian communities and co-creating with fellow beings and living a more simplistic existence with probably less technology and less regulation. So it feels like we're going to come in to a more tangible expression of the differences of how some of us want to live and everything is possible for everybody that's what we need to remember this year the astrology is such that those possibilities can come up there will be a lot of people starting to work with different co-creators than maybe they did before and starting to have a deeper sense of who it is they really want to be collaborating with and it's time for us to really look at what the next chapter means and what we maybe don't have in our toolkit. At the moment, there is a lot of fragmentation, a lot of people doing shamanic work or ceremonies or any sort of thing really, because we have a lot of trauma around, but there's also a lot of energetic fragmentation that we're witnessing. And I'm speaking after many, many reports of this from all continents. And it means that some of us need to act to look at how we can really teach people the deeper, deeper fundamentals of what it is to be in community and is to hold space. So I put it to you. If you've been going to a lot of ceremonies or doing a lot of shamanic work or tantra and stuff and you're starting to say that, oh, my energetics are a little bit off, maybe there's something to look at in that and maybe there's some healing to take place. But I feel that the, the highest teaching is really about understanding that that's a stage of a journey. And in the perfection of everything, a lot of people have been on a kind of pause button. And so I put it to you, is ecstatic dance all the time going to your highest place? Is going to ayahuasca ceremonies all the time going to your highest place? Or is it actually part of the journey and what's it leading, what's it want you to step into? I feel that there's a necessary degradation of some things that have become too popular and too accessible to people who might indulge in them without true understanding of how serious they are. But with that also is a perfection of many lessons that are being taught through our communities. So we're starting to run a course from spring 2022 on space holding. And we're going to be looking at things like ceremonies, but we're also doing something different. And I have a lot of experience of working tribally with ceremonies all around the world, with many, many people, wisdom keepers, elders. And so we can give the teaching and what's exotic right now, but that's not what this training is about. There will be a little bit of that, but what we want to train people up in is how to get ready for the golden age and to get ready for these new communities and what that means and to explore that. And so the training is starting online very, very soon, the pre-recorded part of it, but actually we will be having day retreats for the level one and then migrating to longer retreats so that people can really learn what is going on on different levels of community, different lessons, less, uh, levels of society, and start to look at this in a larger framework because I feel that the pause button, where a lot of people will realize, actually I've spent the last three years just doing the same sort of ceremonies and the same sort of thing, and I'm quite fragmented and maybe I'm not growing. We will help people 
to understand more about their purpose, looking at their astrology, things like their gene keys, mapping their personality, and helping them to actually understand what that phase was about, because actually a lot of people who are in these circles at the moment may think, oh, I'm going to become a shaman and things like this. And actually, that's not going to be the role in new society. And actually, that's probably going to be a relief when people really realize what that entails. So if any of this is interesting, please get in touch. We're really excited to be offering this and there's going to be more information very soon. Take care. Ciao, ciao.